<laughs> it's a very exciting day today guys because I just bought a bunch of things from IKEA and we're about to pick it up. Now you might be wondering, the bus later, yung bahay niyo nasa Cebu, di ba? May IKEA ba diyan? Meron na, guys. So, the way this works is wala talagang actual physical store here in Cebu. All I did was shop online and had all the items delivered to a pick-up point here in Cebu, which is Robinson's Galleria. So, mabilis na talaga yung process. Go online and have everything delivered here in Cebu and pick it up. Uh, konting suggestion lang pala, guys. Ang bilis mag-sell out ng mga IKEA items. So, if you like something, buy nyo na agad. Don't wait for it. Don't put it in your cart. Just buy it right away so that you get the item that you want. This is me speaking from experience. Hi, Mark. <laughs> so, si Mark will help us with our orders today. Uh, she can go to dito. So, if you're ever in Cebu and you're looking for help, si Mark. Hi. <laughs> so, this is everything that I ordered. I actually forgot na ko ano yung mga in order ko. <laughs> And dami pala. Sige, let's load it up in the car. Patulong na lang ako. And then, let's go. Guys, nakalimutan ko. Sobrang dami ko palang in order. Check this out. But the whole process was super seamless. Everything took about just five minutes, including yung pagkarga sa kotse, and super easy. I just had to sign a form and then tapos na. So very, very convenient, especially for us Cebuanos. All right, we're finally back home. We have tons of boxes to unbox. Let's see what we got, shall we? Quick suggestion lang guys, when you're installing mga cabinets like this for IKEA, make sure you're not throwing random things away. This looks like a small cardboard piece na pwedeng itapo natin, pero pag tingin niyo sa loob, meron siyang laman ng mga screws and brackets. So, quick tip lang. So, our gym is finally empty now. Natapos na namin install lahat. And I'm excited, I'm excited to show you guys what we've done so far. This is, for me personally, sobrang angst. Angst ko to. <laughs> Kasi dati, used to be all the slippers and all the shoes will be lined up here. And then dun sa dulo, nilalagyan pa ng mga brooms, mga mops. This is like our stock room dati. Pero this is what we've done. So all we did was recycle the old shoe rack. Pero ginawa na namin all slippers. These are our guest slippers. This is Chris's slippers and Chris's slippers, and then my slipper. That's it. That's my... Ito at ito. Pareho pa yung kulay. Fine, I'll keep some slippers. <laughs> and it's just it's the same color. <laughs> and all the shoes nilagay namin dito sa IKEA style cabinet. I chose this in particular para hindi matamaan when we open the doors because this is fairly thin. At first, I was a little bit concerned na baka it's too thin na hindi kasha yung mga sapatos, especially my big shoes. But take a look at this, guys. So, the first level is my level. Even my boots, kasha. And then, on the second level, Chris's shoes. So, dalawang layer siya. You put one layer here and the other layer here. It's pretty cool. And the last layer are, oh, I'm Scotty's chikiting shoes. So cute. <laughs> So, super clean na siya dito, and um, whenever I pass by, ooh, parang maliwanag na siya. That is my impression of this space. But, Slater, saan yung nilalagay yung mga mops and brooms dati? Well, here we go, guys. So, this used to be just a plain wall. Nilagyan lang namin ng Chris's... Fake, fiddly fig. <laughs> fiddly, fiddly, fiddly fig. Fiddly fig. Yes. Okay. And this is actually a shoe cabinet because shoe cabinets are typically more narrow. This is the Klepstad by IKEA. So marami siyang mga shelves, di ba? So we just place the shelves here for future kung kailangan namin. It used to be shelf to lahat. But we turned it into a small broom closet. At least malinis na and they don't have to go all the way to the back para kumuha ng mga ganito. It's 
they get it here. And this is the brooms for the inside of the house. Also, welcome to Slater's Hardware Store and Water Refilling Station. <laughs> this area used to be a mess. These were over here, sobrang sikip. And I have a lot of my hardware tools and hardware things like mga sealants, mga pang repair namin dito sa bahay. Actually, this is overkill. Pero ngayon, we've organized everything into these Besta cabinets. Ang ganda ng Besta cabinet is because it's modular. You can buy this na two-piece siya, pero this one is actually just one piece. And you can connect them together, form them whatever you like. You can stack one on top of the other. And ito, you can even buy shelves for it. So this one was, I think, 350 pesos. So bili ka lang ng shelf if you want more shelves. And this is actually what I also use in my room. Come here. Lastly, and this is what I'm most proud of. Come here. My man cave is newly renovated. These are the best shelves na nakita natin outside. Pero, naingit ako kay Chris kasi sa kanya, again, it's, this is super modular. Yung sa kanya, merong mga drawers dito and merong mga pintuan na nagsiswing. So, I want to do that. So, I'll probably be going back online and purchase the covers for this para mas malinis. And then, dito, I'll make it even more. Lagyan natin ng mga design. Add some manly decor. Yeah. For now, I have my everyday carry here in this little tray. So, whenever I come inside, dito, unload everything and then it's there. Ito is also from IKEA. This is the Sol Clint lamp, pero hindi pa siya nakaplug kasi wala pang light, light bulb. bulb sa loob. But it's pretty though. It's pretty cool. And parang it matches the entire aesthetic of this space. Gold, black, and etc. So ganyan din yung et dito, etc. Mahilig ako sa etc. It, yun yung word for the month, etc. So this whole area used to be bare. Parang when you come inside, medyo nakulangan dito ng design compared to the rest of the room. But I got these floating shelves from IKEA. And sobrang sleek ng floating shelves because you don't see any brackets. So it's a very clean look. And then we just redesigned everything. And all these are my desk items, like my notebooks, my mga ball pen, post-its. Dati used to be here and then I transferred it up here para mas malaki yung working space ko. This lamp is also from IKEA and I have all my mostly used items also here. And on top, we have our photos. I have my favorite books. Actually, one favorite book and two notebooks. <gasps> you stole my book stand. Matagal na itong nandito, mine. love. And I stole your plant. You did. And we have an extra mic for our podcast. Follow our podcast on Spotify, guys. Because ngayon... Dun, 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 dun. 100,000 subscribers on YouTube na si Sky Podcast. Wow! <laughs> so I feel like, especially with this space, these shelves, parang it brought a lot of life to this area. Hindi niya bare. And uh, hindi niya mukhang hindi pa natapos. <laughs> I hope this little tour and redecoration of the SkyPod gives you a little bit of ideas on how you can improve your space. Para sa akin, this one in particular is my favorite, and I'm so proud because ako lang naglalagay ng mga items nito. Pwede na ba ako maging interior designer? <laughs> Lat na lang. No? If you're interested in IKEA, you can go visit their Pasay store, or if you're from Cebu, pwede tayong dumerecho online, and then just go to the pickup center. Super easy, super simple. That's our video for today, guys. Subscribe and I'll see you later.